Okay, y'all. It's later in the day. I had to come back, child. Anywho, as y'all can probably tell, I got braids in the back. I've never done this before, but we're gonna install this hair with these braids in here. And I'm just gonna make it work, and y'all gonna see this because I wanted to know, like, what if I had braids and I just wanted to switch it up? So we all finna find that right in the book now. Period. So look at the hair. Let's get into it. Let me get this on. Oh my gosh, this is 24 inch curly. I, I love this. This is so cute. Oh, and it's breathable. I love them breathable joints. Y'all know I'm the glueless queen, okay? Save your edges, y'all. Y'all don't have to be bald head. You don't have to be bald head. And then look at the inside. It is super easy to just like breathe the summertime your head be swimming it got clips on the side and down at the bottom and then look at the baby hairs it's already pre-made look at that look at those baby hairs i don't know if y'all can see them for real for real so let me try to show y'all like this you see them baby hairs baby they baby all right period let me put a little bit of foundation on here and we're gonna pop this Suck on. Y'all, I'm so excited. I just want to see how it's going to look with some braids. Because I feel like if I do this and it works, I'm going to be the crack the code. Don't y'all think? Because I feel like I've seen people put wigs on top of their sew-ins. Why you can't put no wigs on top of your braids? Now, mind you, I do have the first row taken out. Um, For the simple fact that I'm getting it rebraided. So I wonder, I'm going to have to do it again when I actually have braids in the front. But what I'm going to try to do is put a beehive, like, similar to a beehive swirl at the lower back, like, only right here. And then, so the top can be super flat. Because the braids, they're in, um, what do they call them? Them things? They're in windows. So they all lay flat. So I really shouldn't have no problem. But let's see. Let me tighten up the band because my head little... Well, let me tighten it a little bit because I got these braids. But I feel like this don't come out right. And I feel like I'm going to unlock something. So let me try to. Let me see. Something. I'm gonna show y'all something today. I'm, I'm gonna do a double just because I don't know. I honestly feel like it's fine just the way it is because it's also a closed wig. If it was a front one, then we may have some trouble, but y'all, I should be good. Oh, let's put it on and see. Let's just pause here for a moment. Let's just pause here for a moment and get into what I just did. Mm -hmm. Yep, that did just happen. I did put this hair, yes, all them braids, this down to my booty. I wrapped them up and put them at the back and I put this wig on top and you can't tell. Yes, I did that. Y'all, look at this hair, dear. Why is the lace see-through? What are you talking about? You can't see nothing? Y'all, I ain't did no flat iron, no nothing. The baby hairs is baby hair and they perfect little baby hairs. Okay, Julie is flat as shit at the top. Oh my gosh, I really feel like I done cracked the code. I feel like I should have maybe not did it so tight and did it a little rounder, more like a, a, a head wrap. Like when you wrap your hair when you get a silk press or something. Um, or you just get a fresh perm, but period. I would go out just like, I'm finna go somewhere. Cause y'all know my hair ain't done. Baby, I'm finna. Bye y'all. Let me, let me make sure I do everything I'm supposed to say. Hold on. Uno momento. Okay. So before I get off, I'm gonna give the, my, my final, this is my final, final, final review. I love this hair. It is very soft. 
Like, it's very easy to just put my hands through it. I ain't put no mousse, nothing. This is straight out the pack. Straight out the pack. No shedding. No shedding is coming off. None. It is a very good length. I really do like that. I feel like the wear and go of it, I literally, y'all see me pull it straight out the pack. It ain't been no in-between. I put a little little foundation on one of the wig caps. I mean, and on, I didn't even put it on the wig cap. I just put it on the lace and look at how blended it is. And look at how full it looks, y'all. And mind you, I got a whole freaking set of braids up under here. Bye. Bye. I don't know what else to say, but that Julia, if you don't go get one from Miss Julia hair, you miss it out. You, you get left in the back. You get left back there. So if you want this hair, make sure you go down in the description box below. I'm going to have everything linked down there. Also, their website, they have so many other options to choose from on their site, y'all. Everything you can think of, frontal, 613. Then they got, you know, different textures. Then they have different, you know, variety of hair. It's just a whole bunch to choose from. So make sure y'all go to their site. Make sure y'all click that link down below. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe on my channel, y'all, because we're trying to grow the channel. We're trying to get there. So with that being said, be blessed, don't stress, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye!